Okay guys, well I'm down here in the Connecticut house basement again, uh, obviously as you saw the title. And I just thought I'd give you some updates on uh, what was going on down here. I remember um, I told you last time um, we're trying to get the radon levels down and we had a couple of uh, updates planned. So um, I'll just show you once again. Um, this was the regular pipe right here. We know we started with this one. You know, it comes out of the slab, goes up, the dye pressure gauge on it and everything. Okay. And since last time, I can show you some of the updates that were done. They used polyurethane caulk on all the seams and cracks on the floor. Because, like, you know, it settles over time. And it's been about a month later, and I don't see any cracks in the, in the, in the um, caulking whatsoever. So that's good. And um, these were just natural seams in the floor, but they still seal those just to be safe. And, um, and you can see that they did some stuff over here. Now... Check out this thing right here. This is the new radon exhaust pipe, okay? What he did was he drilled into the slab there and ran a new pipe, a four inch pipe this time, which I'm happy about, a four inch pipe over to there and to the end. I'll get to there in a minute. Um, so what he did was he, he drilled a couple of holes in the slab. Let me see if I can find them. Uh, yeah, like right here, see this little spot right here? He drilled a couple of holes into the slab and he measured vacuum pressure that was w under the slab from that pipe right there. And just that pipe by itself, it really was, you really weren't getting much in this area in the alcove and also over there by the, um, by the air handler. So what he did was he drilled a hole in there, ran the pipe up, and it goes all across here as you can see. And um, he used a 45 degree angle here because, you know, if you use a 90, it restricts airflow a little bit more. So he wanted to get the best airflow possible. Then it goes out here. And then, as you know, it comes out there and, and up to the exhaust fan that you saw outside earlier. That's where it goes to. And you can see there's a little power switch for it right there. And I can hear it running right now. And he set it up very nicely in a really good way to make it look uh, as unintrusive, I mean, it's an unfinished basement, but I guess you could say as unintrusive as possible. Now, in this particular case, you can see that the gauge isn't as high as the other pipe, but this is a larger pipe. So that's why there's not as much um, pressure going up, but it's still moving a ton of air. And like you saw earlier, and you can see here's more of the caulking. He caulked around the pipe very nicely and all the cracks and everything all the way down there. Um, he also, <clears throat> excuse me, he also did a couple of cracks over here and seams all along here as well. Very, very good. Um, you may hear some water running right now. That's just because we're trying to, since we have PEX lines and the water lines don't get used at all, we try to just flush them out um, every now and then. And uh, everything's all good right here. And air conditioning season is upon us. Actually, it's very warm today, but I'll make a separate video on that, as you know. You can hear water going down the pipe right now. All right, very good. And this, there's a crack right here that he sealed up by the pit there and all along here. So um, they definitely, oh, they also did a, um, a pressure test, I think, over here. Somewhere over here. Oh, there it is right there. They did a pressure test right there, as you can see. So, um, yeah, as far as everything goes, um, they definitely um, definitely have a lot, much more vacuum on the under the slab now to get all the radon out in all the areas that they tested. So this pipe is making a huge difference, like over there and over there. I think it was like negative 15 or negative 30. One of them was negative 30, which was very good. It means it's getting a very good vacuum. Um, so yeah, it's, um, it's pulling out much more than just that pipe alone. So, um, so far, um, this pipe, I think, is doing its job. And we're going to put another test kit in here sometime today and then see where it goes from there. Um, this is just the uh, sunroom area rug. We just moved it down here uh, for the time being. And uh, yeah, so uh, what is kind of nice is that, you know, the um, both, both radon pipes are make a little bit of an air noise or hissing noise down here, very gentle, which is nice. Like, you know, just enough noise where, you know, if the water heater or the air handler isn't running, puts just enough nice noise down here. It doesn't sound dead silent. If there's one thing I don't like, it's dead silent rooms. I never did like that. But yeah, once again, here you go. Um, here's the pipe. Goes up there. And goes across there and outside to the fan that you saw before when I showed you the outside. And I think there was one more crack they sealed over here. And again, I don't see any cracks in this caulking, so that's great. Very happy to see that. Yep, right here. He did a, he did a thing all around here. 
and it came out very, very nice. And there were no cracks over there, everything was okay. And you can hear the water going down the pipe right now. Okay, guys, and that's about it. Just a short basement update for you. Um, actually, you know, if you want, just, just for fun, I'll show you the water meter moving since they're flushing the lines out. You can see it going right there. So, uh, yeah, kind of cool having an indoor water meter. You can actually see it move. And, uh, yeah, guys, that's it, okay? So, um, just did all the caulking around here at the corners. Did very good sealing uh, system, uh, better than it was before. And um, we're going to put the test kits uh, down here, and uh, hopefully the results uh, for this will be better. And um, I do still need to do more work on the hot water line insulation, but um, that will come too as time goes. Not as cold down here since it's really hot out. It's like in the 90s right now, believe it or not. So, hey, if I, if I get to wear my shorts and sandals and no coat, I'm very happy with that. <laughs> Okay, guys, and there you go. So, um, hope you really enjoyed that. And uh, new radon system has been running for over a month now. And hopefully it's doing its job. And we will find out when we get the test results, all right? But I'm sure it's doing just fine. So, as usual, thank you very much for watching. And take care.